Hi friends, welcome to the channel Dinners. Here we are discussing about obstetrics and gynecology nursing questions and answers with their rationales. If you are not subscribed to our channel, please subscribe. And question starts now. Before that, uh, Saftadek Hospital Nursing Officer exam is upcoming. So prepare well and best wishes. Question starts now. First question. The pad of subcutaneous adipose tissues lying in front of the pubis in females is known as labia majora, mons veneris, clitoris, labia minora. Correct answer is mons veneris. Mons veneris is also known as mons pubis. Next question. Which of the following is the largest paraurethral gland? Prostate gland, Bartholin's gland, clitoris, Skinny's gland. Correct answer is Skinny's gland. Skinny's glands are homologous to the prostate in males. Next question. The vaginal pH from the puberty to menopause is acidic mainly because of the presence of which microorganism? Acidophilus bacillus, Dodolins bacilli, E. coli, Klebsiella. Correct answer is Dodolins bacilli. Dodolin bacilli produce lactic acid from the glycogen present in the Exfoliated cells. The pH varies with estrogenic activity and ranges between 4 to 5. Next question. The pouch of Douglas is related to the vaginal canal by superiorly, laterally, posteriorly, anteriorly. Correct answer is posteriorly. The recto uterine pouch, also known as pouch of Douglas, is the extension of the peritoneal cavity between the rectum and posterior wall of the vagina in the female human body. Next question. The accessory reproductive organ formed by modified sebaceous gland is breast, ovary, uterus, vagina. The correct answer is breast. The breast usually extends from the second to sixth rib in midclavicular line concerned with the lactation followed following childbirth. Next question. Which ligaments mainly support the breast? Broad ligaments, Cooper's ligaments, ligamentum fascia, Ovarian ligaments. Correct answer is Cooper's ligaments. The Cooper, Cooper's ligaments are the fibrous septa which extend from the skin underlying pectoral fascia and provide support to the breast. Next question. Menstruation is unrelated with ovulation and anovular menstruation is quite common during adolescence following childbirth and in women approaching menopause. The statement is true or false, none of this. The statement is true. Menstruation is unrelated with ovulation and anovular menstruation is quite common during adolescence following childbirth and in women approaching menopause. Next question. The endometrium of the pregnant uterus is known as chorionic villi, decido, trophoblast, marula. Correct answer is decido. It is named decido because 
much of it is shed following delivery. The well developed decido consists superficial compact layer, intermediate spongy layer, thin basal layer. Next question. The fetal blood flow through placenta is about 100 ml per minute, 200 ml per minute, 400 ml per minute, 700 ml per minute. Correct answer is 400 ml per minute. It is mainly facilitated by the pumping action of fetal heart. The pressure in the umbilical artery is around 60 mm of H mercury and umbilical vein is about 10 mm of mercury. Next question. In intrauterine death or IUD, the color of amniotic fluid is, is become golden color, meconium stained, greenish yellow, dark brown or tobacco juice. Correct answer is dark brown or tobacco juice. Golden color is seen in RH incompatibility and meconium stained uh, amniotic fluid seen in fetal distress, greenish yellow amniotic fluid seen in post maturity babies. Next question The two umbilical arteries carry venous blood from the fetus to placenta. The umbilical arteries derived from internal iliac arteries of fetus, superior vena cava, femoral arteries of fetus. Internal jugular veins of fetus. Correct answer is internal iliac arteries of fetus. The umbilicus or funis consists of two umbilical arteries and two umbilical veins initially. The right umbilical vein will disappear around fourth month. From the fourth month onwards, umbilicus consists two umbilical artery and one umbilical vein. Next question. Which of the following test has highest sensitivity in diagnosis of pregnancy? Direct agglutination test, ELISA, radioimmunoassay or RIA, fluoroimmunoassay or FIA. Correct answer is radioimmunoassay or RIA. It can detect pregnancy as early as 8 to 9 days after ovulation and gives highest sensitivity of 0.001 international unit of HC, HCG per ml. Next question. The process of stimulation of uterine contraction that is both in frequency and intensity that are already present but found to be inadequate is known as Induction of labor, augmentation of labor, stripping the membrane, cervical ripening. Correct answer is augmentation of labor. Induction of labor means initiation of uterine contractions after the period of viability by any method for the purpose of vaginal delivery. Stripping the membranes is a surgical method of inducing cervical ripening by digital separation of chorioamniotic membranes from the wall of the cervix and lower uterine segment. Cervical ripening is a series of complex biochemical changes in the cervix which is mediated by or hormones. Next question. Which of the following condition is not an indication for induction of labor? Post maturity, intrauterine fetal death, premature rupture of membrane, umbilical cord prolapse. Correct answer is umbilical cord prolapse. Contraindication of induction of labor, which includes Contracted pelvis or cephalopelvic uh, disproportion, mold presentation, previous classical cesarean section, uteroplacental factors like vasa previa, placenta previa, etc., 
active genital herpes infection, high risk pregnancy with fetal compromise, heart disease, pelvic tumor, elderly primary gravida, umbilical cord prolapse, cervical carcinoma. Next question. Which route of administration of prostaglandins for induction of labor having fewer side effects? Oral, intravenous, intramuscular, transvaginal. Correct answer is transvaginal. Systemic side effects may be troublesome especially with oral or intravenous infusion. Vaginal root use got minimal side effects. The side effects include nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, pyrexia, bronchospasm, tachycardia, chills, cervical laceration and tachycystole or in severe case uterine rupture. Next question. The use of femidom that is female condom is an example of which kind of contraception? Barrier method, natural contraception, IUDs, steroidal contraception. Correct answer is barrier method. Next question. The indication for withdrawal of the pills are following except protection against unwanted pregnancy, severe migraine, visual or speech disturbances, sudden chest pain. Correct answer is protection against unwanted pregnancy. The other indication for withdrawal of oral pills are unexplained fainting attack or acute vertigo, severe cramps and pains on legs, excessive weight gain, severe depression prior to surgery and patient wanting pregnancy. Next question. Which of the following reflex is the gentle tap over the forehead and the eyes will blink? Grasp reflex, Moro reflex, rooting reflex, glabellar reflex. Correct answer is glabellar reflex. Next question. The nitrogen base which is not present in DNA is adenine, thymine, guanine, uracil. Correct answer is uracil. Nitrogenous bases present in DNA are adenine, thymine, guanine and cytosine. The nitrogen base present in RNA instead of thiamine in DNA Uracil present. Next question. The plasma protein which is necessary for the blood clotting. Albumin, globulin, fibrinogen, hemoglobin. The correct answer is fibrinogen. The blood, the blood plasma without clotting factors is known as serum. Next question. Which fruit is known as lover's apple? Pineapple, green apple, tomato, grapes. Correct answer is tomato. Next question. Gamma rays can cause gene mutation, sneezing, burning, Fever. Correct answer is gene mutation. Next question. Which among the following is not an indication for exchange transmission in newborn? Physiological jaundice, cord blood bilirubin level more than 4 mg per deciliter, rising rate of bilirubin is over 1 mg per deciliter per hour. Despite of phototherapy, total bilirubin level 20 mg per deciliter or more. Correct answer is physiological jaundice. 
Exchange transfusion is a life-saving procedure in severely affected hemolytic disease of newborn. Through exchange transfusion, the incidence of kernicterus has also reduced. Next question. Daltonism is a night blindedness, color blindness, atherosclerosis, arteriosclerosis. Correct answer is color blindness. Daltonism means color blindness of red green type. It is also known as deuteranopia or deuteranomaly. Next question. Sickle cell anemia is a deficiency disease, genetic disease, contagious disease, mental disease. Correct answer is genetic disease. Question hands here. And thank you for watching this video. Please like and share this video. And don't forget to subscribe this channel. And Please click the bell button. Thank you.